All right, let's go. Hey guys, today I'm gonna be ranking bridge maps. We got some OG ones in here. I can already see them, but I want to get straight into it. I don't want this to be a long video. So the first one is Treehouse. Now Treehouse is is a pretty basic map. It's a it's a pretty big hippo. You know, it takes a little while. It can be hard to it can be a little bit hard to score. But as you can see in this image, you can see those those stairs. This can be very effective when you're bypassing after a bypass. Um in the, at the bottom of the hippo there's a little thing where you can mine two blocks and go up. That's very effective. So when you have a bypass at the bottom, you can go you can go through that way. Very effective, very hard to, to defend against. So I say Treehouse is an A A tier map. Condo. Now, I believe what people say that Kondo is a competitive map. I disagree. I think Kondo is shit. Mostly because if you're playing this competitively in a tournament and they get the upper hand in map development, you're screwed. Like, there's a thing called spawn blocking and that is greatly decreasing your chances of winning. So I say this is not a competitive map and is a terrible map, but it does have some side islands that are pretty nice to work with. So I give it a D. Flora, you know, a lot of people like this map. I hate this map. I, I think there's also another D tier. It's not exactly F tier because you can buy, like, very, bypass is very dominant in this map, of course. But I feel like it's just, that's the point. Like, it's, it's so offensively bound that I, I can't figure out how to defend. Also, no one plays this map anymore. It's, it's like a dead map now. But. It's a D-tier map. I don't like it. I'm sorry. Aquatica is easy. Yes. I mean, come on. I mean, it's great for bypassing. You can defend pretty easily. It's not hard to defend. Uh, well, it, it can be. It can be, but depends on how skilled you are. Pretty much. But I think this is like the perfect map. You know? Like, it has three entrances. You can go on top. I mean, there's so many possibilities you can do with this map. And I think that's beautiful and lovely. I think it's a good map. Personally, I think it's a good map. One of the best, in my opinion, actually. Sunstone. Uh, Sunstone. Like, no one plays these maps. I don't know. Like, C tier? Like, I actually don't mind it. I mean, people say it's bad, but I think if you just move this back one, it would have been a good map. I don't know why people hate it, to be honest. It's actually a pretty decent map. I mean, I guess I guess the goal room could be pretty annoying, but besides that, it's a, it's a good map. I mean, I, like, it's not great, you know. I, honestly, it's a odd popular play. I'll put it at B. I think it's not even that bad. Lighthouse, it's just terrible. I mean, even with the rework, it's still terrible. I mean, it's impossible to score. No one plays this map. Do we even really care? I mean, do we do we even really care? Same with, like, Cheesy. Cheesy is the exact same map, but it's just it's impossible to score, and no one even plays it. I, I honestly forgot Mr. Cheese was even a map, to be honest. I low-key forgot that Mr. Cheesy was a map. Man. That's crazy. Urban is an easy S tier. I mean, I think that's pretty obvious within the community. I mean, it's very bypassable. Very defendable. Uh, You know, uh, roofing's pretty hard on it. Same with um cratering. And those are the worst two strats ever made. So I think this is the perfectly balanced map and the best map. Yeah, I think it's the best map in uh, Bridge. Humbly, in my opinion. Hyperfrost. Oh, people are going to hate me for this one. I think Hyperfrost is late here. <laughs> okay, hear me out. It's really fun to play. And it, oh, it's PvP, but like... The side islands make it so fun. I don't know. And you can go like... There's holes in the main bridge that you can go under. You make like a huge under system here. It's really fun. I don't know. People say it's PvP, but like. Okay. I mean, bridge is PvP. Mostly. Sometimes. Sometimes it is. Well, now it is. But I think Hyperfrost is actually pretty good. I mean, it's an easy hippo to make. Like, it's not hard. I mean, it takes a little while, but it's not bad. But, I mean, it's pretty easy to defend. It's really easy to defend. It's pretty hard for bypassers, but I mean, I'm a defense man, so it doesn't bother me that much. 
Uh, Tundra. Now, I don't know if this is after the rework or before the rework. I'm going to say it's after, because that's a better version. And I think it's just C tier. I mean, it's still super hard to to um score. But at least you have a second option of going back. But that still is, like, you know, pretty difficult to score on. Because, like, it's, it's a very small jump to make. You don't have a lot of room behind you. But I think it's just a, like, a perfect, like, it's just such a mid map you know it's so mid you know it's like it's all right it's, it's mid uh, galaxy's b tier um i think it's fun i think it's a fun map it's an easy hippo wings are very very good on this map um yeah, it's a very wing dominant map side on is low wings very effective i just the only issue is that you can spawn block on it even though it is like barely a spawn block really but it still can be pretty annoying and competitive. Like when you're playing competitively, that can be pretty frustrating. But I think it's a very, very B tier map. It would be in front of, of course. These would be in front of each other. Aquatica is just in the same as Dojo, or Dojo is the same as Aquatica. I mean, it's it's just a revamped skin. It's, like it's just a skin map of Aquatica. I mean, do I really have to say anything else? It's just licorice. Uh, yeah. Licorice. Um, D tier. I don't even know what to say about licorice. I think it just sucks. <laughs> I mean, spawn block. Um, what else? The the side islands don't really do much. Real, really. Um, I don't know. It's just a mid map. <laughs> it's just really mid. I I don't know what to say about this one. This it just kind of sucks. A uh, boo. You know, people, okay, people really like Boo, but it's good, but I don't think it's S tier, because, how do I explain this? It's such a nightmare in solos. I mean, to a certain point where, if you ever even think of bypassing, you're most likely going to get erased. Um, unless you play around with map development, of course, but. And doubles, it's just a PvP like game the entire time with a wing of course but i just i don't know it's it, it's balanced like, i won't lie it's very balanced but i don't like it, uh, it's gonna be better if, it's gonna be like the best of these but i don't know it's hard to explain but i just don't like how it plays it's just i feel like in the current meta, it's just a lot of PvP. And that's all it really is. Atlantis? Like, <laughs> I don't know. C tier? Like, I don't know. The hippo's really hard. The hippo's huge. Um, No one plays this. Like, I don't know why I'm even ranking these ones. But this one is just, like, it's super mid. You know? Like, I, I haven't played it in so long, I don't even know what to say about it anymore. It's alright. It's okay, I guess. Sorcery's in the same as Boo, of course. But I like Sorcery's aesthetic more, so I'm going to put that ahead. I think Boo, I don't like the aesthetic of Boo. Is that, is that weird to say? Even though it's Halloween, I don't like it. Stumped? I like she. Okay. I really like Stumped. Um, I thought it was really fun to play. I mean, it's a big enough hippo where it's like not hard to score on. And of course, these islands actually do something, unlike um, Licorice. So I think this is actually a good map. A hippo's good. Goal room you can get into decently easily. Um, it's pretty fun to bypass with. I think it's a good map, actually. In all fairness, I think it's a good map. Fortress? Uh, sorry. Oh, God. Like, competitive doubles is a wing. And PvP. That's the entire That's the entire game. Halftime. If you're playing high games, high competitive games, that's all you're going to see. It's just a wing. And PvP. And sometimes they'll bypass. I mean, for pressure, maybe, yeah. But, I mean, that's really the strat. Solos is the same thing, to be honest. I mean, that's all you can really play with Fortress. I mean, maybe you can be different. I don't know. Maybe you can do, do some naughty stuff. But that's how I how I view it. I think it's a C tier. I kind of don't like it. But uh, I guess we'll move it to B tier. Chronon. Uh, C tier. Like, I don't know. I mean, it's, it's fun, but... It's so, it's so, like, 
I don't know. It's just off, you know. I mean, it's it's like it's, something's not right. I feel like it could be it has a potential to be good, but something's missing from it. I just don't know what. I mean, the hippo is impossible to get into, but once you get into it, it's impossible for the defender. But the problem is, is getting into that hippo is impossible. But other than that, it's like, I mean, it's pretty hard to get to drop into the goal room when they're like going in. But like, it's pretty hard to just PVP them down the bridge. In solos, is a lot harder to defend because you're most likely not going to be hippoing. Other than that, it's just, it has the potential, but I just think it's not there. And Twilight is easy as F tier. Yeah. Twilight is be spawn blockable. The bottom does nothing. I mean, I don't think anyone has ever done something with that. It's just like, I feel like there's not a lot of effort into the, No one really put effort into making that map, you know? And I think that's it. These are my bridge rankings it looks pretty even actually three 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 five i mean i think this is a go to tier list in my opinion i don't think people could even hate on this actually i think this is the best map honestly i think it's the best tier list i've ever made i think this clears the tnt tag one so yeah thank you guys for watching uh make sure to hit like and subscribe because i'm trying to get to um um 50 uh 50 subscribers that's like my my dream and um uh, i'll see you guys later